So I like to have a wheel to use with my students when we're doing activities or notes in class um, to kind of increase participation and keep them um, on their toes. So I entered all my students' names, and these are not my real students' names, um, but I would enter my real students' names um, on the wheel. And then so I don't have to retype this wheel every day because I have multiple classes. So I changed the list for every class. I'm going to click on the wheel for it to spin and then click on it and click copy. I'm going to come over here and control V. I'm going to paste it. So I have my wheel. I'm going to come up to the top here and click share. Click continue. And then have the option to change the wheel or not. I don't want a student to check out after their name has been spun. So I'm going to leave the wheel the same. Click continue. It's going to give me a URL. So I'm going to copy that. Come back over here. Click on the image. Click link. Control V, apply. So I would do this for each of my classes. So I would put um, a wheel um, in different slides. So I had one for each class. So what happens is if I am presenting and I need a student, I would just go to this class's wheel, I would click on it. It's going to take me to the wheel that I already made. So again, the nice piece is if I have multiple classes, I don't have to recreate the wheel every day. Um, it's just already made. I just click on it, and then there's my wheel for this class. I would click spin, and it would um, tell me which student is going to answer the question um, or help me fill out something. So this is what I would do. It saves you a lot of time, I feel like, and a lot of retyping.